in this class we are going to discuss how to find the pedal equation of the car r to the power m this is equal to a to the power m into sin m theta plus b to the power m into cos m theta right this is the polar car we have to find the pedal equation of this car here we use two important result of differential calculus okay and the first one is r d theta dr this is equal to tan theta and this is p small p this is equal to r sin phi okay and these two relation we already proved in earlier lecture if we want to see this to prove you search the description box in this video okay and roughly i say what is all the symbol in a rough sketch if in a polar car let o be the pole and let this is the car okay this is the car this is equal to r this is equal to f of theta polar car which is r theta and let p be any point p be any point sorry let this point is p or we take this is p dash the coordinate of p dash is r theta we draw a tangent at p and this tangent makes angle makes angle psi with positive polar axis this is ox and this is the radial vector which is denoted by r and this is the vectorial angle this is theta and we draw perpendicular perpendicular on the tangent from the pole this is p this is small p this is on and angle between the tangent and the radius vector is known as phi okay these are all symbol involved into relation now we going to the main problem we first let a to the power m this is equal to capital r into cos alpha and b to the power m this is equal to capital r into sin alpha then the given relation becomes r to the power m this is equal to r sin m theta cos alpha plus cos m theta sin alpha and this is given by r sin m theta plus alpha this is r to the power m where r is clearly given by r square this is equal to a to the power 2m plus b to the power 2m that is r this is equal to root under a to the power 2m plus b to the power 2m okay now we have to find the pedal equation what is pedal equation a relation between p and r is said to be pedal equation this is p and this is r the relation between p and r is said to be pedal equation now taking logarithm on both side we get m log r this is equal to log capital r plus log sin m theta plus alpha now differentiating both side with respect to theta we get m 1 by r dr d theta this is equal to zero because r is a constant plus this is m by sin m theta plus alpha into cos m theta plus alpha okay so m into and we write this relation by using from the first useful relation this is obviously cot theta because r d theta d r this is equal to tan theta so we put here cot theta okay and sorry this is not theta this is phi right this is cot phi where this is cot phi and this is given by m into cot of m theta plus alpha m m cancel out and from here we get phi this is equal to m theta plus alpha right now putting the value of phi putting the value of phi 
in the second relation we get p this is equal to r into sin phi and this is equal to r into sin phi phi means m theta plus alpha and what is sin m theta plus alpha sin m theta plus alpha from here we get sin m theta plus alpha this is equal to r to the power m by capital r and we write r to the power m into r by capital r why we put sin m theta plus alpha in terms of in terms of r because we have to eliminate theta from this relation and getting the relation between p and small r so the equation becomes r to the power m plus 1 this is equal to p into capital r and what is the value of capital r this so we get r to the power m plus 1 this is equal to p into root under a to the power 2m plus b to the power 2m and this is the pedal equation of the given polar equation okay this is pedal equation okay and we see that this relation and this relation two relation here play important role to solve the problem or to find the pedal equation of the polar equation right this is very very important problem of your university previous year paper thank you thank you for watching